Hi everyone. Welcome to pdf.co. In this video tutorial, we will show you how to use the Bubble API connector to translate an English PDF invoice into the German language. We will use this sample PDF invoice in this demo. Let's begin. First, log into your Bubble account and go to my templates page. Next, click on the new template button. Let's fill out the template form to create a new template. Now, click on the edit icon to open the template. Click on the start with a blank page button and close the assistant. We will build a form and add four input elements. For the first input, add the PDF URL. For the second input, add the language from. For the third input, add the language to. For the fourth input, add the async. Now, let's add a button to send a request. For the button, type in translate. Now, go to plugins tab and add a plugins. On your install new plugins, Look up for API Connector and click on the Install button. Once the API Connector is installed, click on the Add Another API button. Let's configure the API Connector. In the API Name field, type in your preferred API name. In the name field, enter your desired name. In the Uses drop down box, select the Action option. In the Data Type drop down box, choose your preferred data type. Let's select Post for Method and enter the PDF.co PDF Translate API endpoint. You can get the endpoint in pdf.co API docs. Let's add headers, type in except for the key. And type application slash JSON for value. Also under headers, Type in X API key and enter your PDF.co API key for value. You can get the API key on your PDF.co dashboard. Now, let's add parameters. For the first key, type URL and input the source file URL for value. In the second key, type in lang from. And type en for value. For the third key, type in lang to. 
and type DE for value. In the fourth key, type async and set false for value. We will now put a check mark in queries checkbox. Then, click on the initialize call button. When the API connector is set up correctly, pdf.co pdf translate will return the sample values. Now, go to the workflow tab and click on the box to add an event. Select the elements and choose an element as clicked options. Let's add an action and select the pdf.co pdf translate plugin. Let's map the dynamic values. In the URL field, select the input PDF URLs value. In the Lang from field, select the input from languages value. In the Langto field, select the input to languages value. In the async field, select the input asyncs value. Let's add another action, select the navigation and choose the open an external website. For destination, select the PDF translates body URL result. Then, click the preview button. Now, enter the source PDF URL. Next, add in for English language. Then, add D for German language. And false for async. Now, click on the translate button to see the result. Here's the translated PDF invoice from English to German language. We've got a lot of video tutorials, you may visit our YouTube channel, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and click the notification bell icon. Thank you for watching.